Essa música é do Fabinho De mais dois amigos dele, dois parceiros dele Y'all see that? Freezing rain all day, every day. Well, not every day. It was literally 80 degrees like two days ago. And it's gonna be freezing rain in like under 30 degrees all day. I can expect snow, sleet, freezing rain, and while every other sane person is inside their house with the heat on, I'm going to go outside and make a video because I'm Alan. I'm like immune to the cold. Let's do this. <laughs> There's a whole herd of Canadian geese. They're not aggressive in the fall time because they nest in the spring, so they're not gonna mess with me. See, you wouldn't think it would fall. It doesn't look like there's that much ice, but I guess it's a lot more because that's all falling down. I've got other journeys and destinations to go to, so let's get out of here. Every day you get to walk to the top of a tree. All of you who know me personally will know I'm a sucker for winter time. They got the geese back over there. And there go some more collapsed trees. The sketchiest part is walking through the breakage when right above you are some more branches looking like they're just ready to fall in your head. I don't think I died though. I don't think I died. Alright guys, I might be in trouble. I've lost complete feeling in my hand. That is so delayed. Like I'm telling my hand to go and there's like a second behind. Whew. Water's gotten into my shoes, so my socks are no longer dry, and my shoes are wet, and they're cold. So, if I lose a foot, I ain't gonna lose a foot. I gotta continue running. That's like my destiny. It's like run. So, I, I would be darned if I lost a foot. But, man. Woo. We've got a couple more destinations I want to hit up before I get up out of here. I'm brave and cool for y'all. Y'all appreciate this. This is Langston Winter Wonderland. All right. fact you guys should all know whenever it's extremely cold outside as comfortable as it may seem to sit here in the heat and allow your hands to warm completely back up you don't want to do that because the repeated thawing and freezing and warming and freezing of your hands could actually cause more tissue damage in turn than if you were to just keep them cold until you're able to fully warm them up so I'm going to get back out into the cold before my hands fully warm up and subject myself to this pain for for YouTube I guess I don't know I want to go in there, but is it really worth it? Like this tree literally just collapsed. You know what? Live life to the fullest, you only live once. It's like an avalanche, you know? If you're too loud, it could all snap. 
for some snacks. Tweakage, it's literally over my head. The tree that just collapsed like minutes before. Oh. I want to move quickly before my hands get back in dire need of like heat. Follows feels I can always break into like one of these buildings and try to get warm, but we'll see how far that gets me. Whew. All in a icy day at Langston University, man. Oklahoma, it was 80 degrees two days ago. I'm used to it, but other people feel like disrespected. Wow, I wish I caught that on camera. That part just collapsed over there. I'm finna, this is the path that most people take from scholars to the cafeteria just to eat. It's not completely snowed over. And I'm gonna be that guy who walks up under it. Top to bottom. There's a bench in there. Pain, all I feel is pain. <laughs> the rain and the temperature out of here are insane to say the least, but I have to get a few more things on camera. This right here is a tree that they've been vulnerable for collapse. They have the yellow tape on there. And if you come over this way, this is the band hall, by the way, in the like auditorium where they have like the, the giant like staged thing my barbers path is almost completely impassable thanks to a uh, collapsed trees here very very interesting and all down there like i said that's the music hall to the left and then to the right closer to us is the auditorium here's the library the santa campus tour but if y'all want that let me know because i definitely put that on my channel Oh, let's get back in. It's cold. It's cold. Never a good sign when literal ice has formed on your shoes. Please focus. But that didn't just... That didn't fall there. That froze on my shoe. Okay, so now that we've established what it is and what it looks like, how exactly does it form or how does it occur? So... According to weather.gov, thank you weather.gov, freezing rain occurs whenever the layer of freezing air is so thin that the raindrops do not have enough time to freeze before they reach the ground. Instead, they freeze as they hit the ground or which, upon reaching or coating whatever they contact with. So whether that be tree limbs, the signs, the cars, etc, etc. The, the layer of air that is freezing is closer to the ground level because as we know cold air falls and hot air rises so as everything becomes drenched on top of that it's so cold in this layer of air that they exist in that it in turn freezes over it's like a double whammy it's like the winter wonderland and everything that you like love about like the ice and it being cold without the joy of actually watching it snow or having real snow to play with so freezing rain everyone Anyway, if you've gotten to this point in the video and you watched it this far, I want to say thank you. I'm genuinely appreciative. Um, I'm not really sure what the premise of this episode was or why I did this episode, but I love the cold and it was an excuse for me to get out. So thank you all for supporting that if you made it this far in the video. If you liked the video, go ahead and leave a like. If you want to see more videos that I do or produce content that you want me to produce, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and comment down below what you'd like to see on this channel. My name has been Alan. Catch you in the next episode.
Just paint a mirror when I'm gone Rest in peace to my grief Finally see, so my beliefs is where I lie and I sleep Can't see the future, if I could I'd probably cut that shit short All lot of thoughts, but yes of course I stayed the course, it's my fault I take the blame, the shame, the pain, the rain Ain't nothing changed